Hello everybody, welcome to a new vlog here on Casey Q's. I'm Casey, welcome to my channel. I haven't vlogged in so long. I actually do have some things to update you on. Um, I don't even know where to begin though. But it is Easter weekend. We're about to do some Easter festivities as we do every year and go get it. Simba and Nala are playing with Lil Dem. I really don't even know the last time I walked. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I've walked since my sister had to put her dog Louie down. That was like, I don't think I did. I think that was, that was the beginning of February. I don't know the last time I vlogged, but maybe I should look. Hold on a second. Okay, I've, vlog I've vlogged since that happened, but yeah. Um, update with me. My health isn't at its peak, epitome. It's not doing so great. Um, I am chronically anemic currently. I actually had to be hospitalized for a blood transfusion last weekend. Mar March was a rough month. It was. I don't know if I even, like, when I was vlogging last, I might have been having my really heavy periods, but I don't know if I did or not. But yeah, I had to have a blood transfusion, and then at my follow-up appointment, I found out that I have a mango-sized 12-centimeter fibroid that needs to be surgically removed. So I'm going to learn a little bit more about that Monday. But for right now, I'm trying not to think about it and just enjoy Easter weekend. Right, Mal? Yeah. We're excited about Molly going to nursing school. Oh, my sister Devin broke her ankle the same day I came home from the hospital last Saturday. So it's been a week since she broke her ankle. It's absolutely awful. We're just having a rough go here. <laughs> my dad has pink eye. Like, we're just like falling apart over here. <laughs> Regardless, we're gonna dye eggs and watch Here Comes Peter Cottontail. Beautiful day. It's like not warm though. It's like 30 something degrees. 36 degrees, 45 degrees. I found these at Target today and I want to do a taste test. Oh. I, I wanted to try the Watermelon Smart, Smart Sweets Forever. Because they're like my favorite That's candy. Like You're out of Real focus. Sugar. Okay. It's like purple. What color is this? Are we good? Okay, yeah. yep, you're good. Oh, they smell like, they smell like something for my childhood. It's a good watermelon flavor. Can I have one? Yeah. They look weird. Oh, they're really <laughs> hard. They're different. But if you had smart sweets before, you would know what to expect. They're very similar to the like the sour gummies, the other sour gummies that they have. You want to try one though? Sure. Oh, okay. okay, I know what you mean. Have you had the other ones before? Mm -hmm. The sweet fish are the best. They would almost be better if they didn't have the sour coating on them. Yeah. And they were just watermelon. But, they're alright. Mm -hmm. The Swedish fish version... It's the best. They're like berry flavored. You you have had those ones? Yeah. <clears throat> it's time. We're eating baklava. On them, it's so good. Put stickers on them wow. And put it in the dye, and then it won't die because it's so It's really good, Mom. I'm the one who picked it up. It can actually bought it. Not at the galleries. <laughs> yes, she did. She worked over in that park. No, we were off the floor, weren't they? No. Oh, Molly. She was no, she shared the camera there and she picked up her bit. computer. I might need it for every holiday, though. Probably Mother's Day. Yeah, we gotta get some. Great. Chick Chick. Gina would do that. They never heard of Peter Cotton Sam.
also I hate the song challenges when like kids from that are like Molly's age literally don't know any of the songs. They're like I have I think they have to be lying in some They have to be. They're like What is that? wants to do what? Now it's exciting. Yeah. Have you ever seen the dog that will only eat it if they put it in the microwave? Alright guys, my camera died earlier when we were making, decorating the bunny cake, but I'm home now. I have all of Simba and Nala's toys and treats for their baskets laid out on the table here. I went a little crazy. I'm sure people go crazier than this, but I love these pigs. Aren't these cute? I love them. Alright, so... I think I'm going to do a treat basket and a boy basket. I don't know because I have two different size baskets. This one right here with the blue stuff in it was Nala's for the past since her first Easter. And then this one my mom gave me. This actually was like one of our Easter baskets when we were a kid. It's a nice one but I don't know. Or I could do Nala and Simba's. I just got to see how they all fit in there. Maybe I will do them separate. They're almost the same size you know, so I took all the tags off all the like plastic stuff and we got these are some of the these are the truck the balls that I got them the chuck it balls because we have a chuck it thing um this is the brand of the pigs in case anyone's wondering and then we got the kong wubbas which are these and then these were just like dollar stuff and I got them a big tire and a bunch of treats. Dino shoes are their favorite. Love these. Got them like some cookies, other treats. So yeah, um let's see how I assemble this. Alright, I decided to make them their own baskets. I put like one of every one of their special treats in there. So we have the dino chews, the dream bone, the blueberry greenies, and then these Waggy, wag, wiggle, waggles, cookies, <laughs> and then all their toys. I love those pigs. They look so freaking cute. And then I have this bag um, from Na for Nala's basket that I had for him last year, but I think I'm gonna leave them undone because they can't undo that anyway. <laughs> so without like destroying the whole basket. So I'd rather them like go over and like pick out what they want to play with or eat in the morning so yeah we got Simba's actually looks fuller than Nala's because Nala's is bigger but they got all the same things everything is even cute easiest decision of my life <laughs> is that good the show is this a good commercial beanie are you enjoying your television watching Is it a good show? Simba, you want puppuccino? Nana, you want puppuccino? Good morning and happy Easter. These two don't know what they have coming to them. Happy Easter, Bean. Say happy Easter. Happy first Easter, Bubba's. Okay, we're gonna put them right over here. We got Peter Cottontail on. All right, let me go get your Easter baskets, Bubba. Hey, everyone. Easter baskets. Here comes Peter. Come here. I got treats for you. Hey, 
good dogs. Okay, here you go. There's treats in here. Boy. Nala. 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 Just a moment. Now here's a light. Here. Yeah. Oh, I thought he had two diamonds. He does have two diamonds. How did he get two? I don't know. Of April Valley. <laughs> hey. Ah. Yes, son. That's yes. not his toy. <laughs> you got your you need a piggy wing? You like your piggy wing? I have decided that we <laughs> Now I get it. <laughs> get it, Beanie. <laughs> you want to go get it? <laughs> Do you want to go get it? <laughs> Come here, Nala. Bring it back. It's like, wow, this is great. Mr. Squeaky Squeaky! Alright, well, you're still gnawing on your treats, and Nala's all done with hers. What else is in your basket, Beanie? You got other toys in there. <laughs> okay. Simba. Hey, it's your basket. Kind of separate them a little bit. Come here, Nala. Nala, get your basket. Here, baby. There's treats in here. <laughs> Happy Easter, my babies. What is in here? There's toys. Nala, Nala. Nala, look. Here, baby. Look. Papa said, what about this one? I forgot about their tire. <laughs> Whoa! Not worried about it. No. Nope. He's still working on that dino chew. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> hey! Kinda. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Do you want to water me opening my basket? And these two are for you and for him too. Oh boy. From this probably not good. He's like really on a diet. He packed a lunch because he has to eat every couple of hours. Oh, packed really? a lunch? He's going to pack a lunch. Ew. This is a peanut butter. I'm bring it to work. Someone will eat it there. Yeah. What's the peanut butter? Ooh. What does it say? So, um, honey bunny. But I was thinking like they have so many mugs for someone that barely drinks hot coffee. <laughs> oh! I need to stop with the mugs, but I love them. Oh, give us the mugs and I'll get you something else. No. I'll give you the $13 that they were. Here are their oh, $15 they're cute, though. The mugs. I love mugs. I know, I drink I mean, I love mugs. a lot of hot coffee. I love mugs. You know I love mugs. It's just, I literally never use them because I don't drink. I don't Here, mom, can you record her? Well, we I need to adjust. You, oh, what, what, Kate, Deb, I'm just like, time you come on. I just need to adjust myself. Here, I'm falling. No, I get. Okay, she's I getting. Yeah, yeah. What is this? Like a little lunch? Yeah. yeah. A little. Oh, that's fun. See, I, I'll. Not that I won't use these, but I'll use this. How do you open it? Oh, I don't know. Oh, the tap just. Cause that's if you want to steam something, you get open it for oh. to heat it up. But this comes off. I mean. Oh, okay. 
This is just for the steam safe gotcha. That's cute. It is cute. I have to cut that for myself. Bubbles. I have so many of these. You always well, say, like, well, one time I put bubbles and you're like, where's our bubbles? Well, when the kids come to your house, I'll use them today. Yeah. Thank you, Mom. The dogs can chase. You're welcome. The bubbles. Oh, I was just talking about even, Nerd Rose. Yeah, you hate them. She's the only one that's ever liked them. You gotta go out. Molly likes them. Does she? I don't think she did. I actually I just told the story to my coworker of how I threw one up. It's nice It's basically just nerds stuck I know, to a weird gummy. I love nerds and I like gummy things, but just after. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, Bubba? Oh, the sun is warm. They're not eating it. That's why I like the decoration. Yeah, what is it? She thinks they're gonna eat the duck? Is that what she just said? Well, Dad should have taken it out. Tell him to. I'll let the dog Easter eggs be again. Uh, yeah, someone drink this beer. You think it's any good? Come here, Demi. Simba. Here. Demi, come on. Come on, you dogs. Get an egg bean. Let's go. Oh, he's going potty. Let's <laughs> Let's go on an egg hunt. Yeah, bean, to get oh, it. What's in there, bean? What's in there? Open it up. Can you get it open? Demi oh, got one this open. Makes the grass of gray. Uh oh. I probably didn't need to bring this thing down with me. Can no, we? No, uh, this is in the yard or something. Can you open it? I'll put it like here so you can see. You gotta open up the eggs. The Easter, the doggy no, Easter bunny. Oh, he got it open. Good boy. Good job, Simba. Oh, they must just pop. No, 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 no. No, you don't want that. You don't want that. There's nothing in there. Good job, Dan. Dummy. Mom is the only one that hasn't opened one yet. Simba's on to his second. Oh. <laughs> Dummy, find more eggs. No, you gotta go get Here, Nala. Nala <laughs> just. This is for children, she's saying. These are for babies. Debbie's older than Nala. <laughs> Simba. Come here, Nala. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Dummy <laughs> likes to open things up and eat them. You're missing out, N Nala. Open it. Open it. What's in here? What's in here? Open it. I'm shocked. I thought. I love them, but oh. if I eat, I'm afraid they're so be pretty. Too cool to yeah. eat. Sorry, I'm in the. Sorry, go ahead. Here. Molly likes to peel yeah. eggs for some reason. Likes the what? She likes to peel them. Here. Well, you hit, which one do you want? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Pick one out for me. Okay. There with you. Oh, it doesn't matter. He'd probably Simba. rather have an escape plan. Okay. Mm. Eat your dinner. Yum, yum, pilgrim. Remember you were a pilgrim? Hello everyone. So it is Tuesday now, not Monday. Yesterday I had a really lazy day. I wasn't feeling 100%. 
And I know at the beginning of this video I kind of <laughs> mentioned how my health hasn't been 100% lately. Um, I haven't been feeling so good. All of March was really rough for me. I had a really heavy period for the whole month. I bled from, this is so much, too much information. I bled for most of the month. I feel like people don't want to know about this, but it, it was awful. And, um, I went to my doctor, um, about two weeks into bleeding and I, I saw my primary care and my gynecologist, we got blood. Um, I was started on, uh, blood pressure medication, thyroid medication, and an iron supplement because my blood count was way down. And then on Saturday, March, or no, Friday, March, 26th or 25th I went to the ER I had two ER visits the first one they discharged me and said that I was fine and then I went home and then the next day after that ER visit I um, felt really weird I was having really strange headaches almost like migraine like headaches which I've never suffered a migraine before but I felt absolutely awful and dizzy and like I was getting spots in my eyes whenever I stood up I had to lay down otherwise my head was like squeezing tight it hurt so bad um so then so I went to the ER on a Thursday and then Friday I went to a different one they admitted me overnight I got a blood transfusion and then they discharged me and I was feeling so much better I'm feeling great um kind of was diagnosed with fibroids I was asking about you know the possibility of having them and they kind of just swept it under the rug and then I had a follow-up appointment with my gynecologist they did another ultrasound and then they found like a really large fibroid in my uterus that they want removed so they had to refer me to a, a different gynecologist that specializes in stuff like that and I spoke with him yesterday I'm still waiting for my appointment to be set up so I am probably gonna have a myomectomy which is really just like removal, removal of these fibroids to protect my fertility is what my doctor told me I still have a really high risk for bleeding they want to make sure that I don't have the bleeding disorder that my mom has so I have to get tested for that and it's just been a lot guys I have a lot going Gonna be in the vlog, Papa? No. What are you doing? <clears throat> so that's where I'm at right now in life. Kind of stressed out. Trying to get through this rough patch. Wait it out until things get better. I wish they could just snap and, you know, sometimes you want to rush and get things over with. Obviously, like, waiting is the worst part when you're not feeling that good and when you just want to go back to your normal life I just don't feel healthy I don't feel good I feel like this whole year I've been really sluggish and not feeling my best which is the truth I have haven't been feeling good at all so there's that I'm about to work a three night stretch and then I'm off the weekend so maybe I'll vlog next weekend I have to see how I'm feeling um I do have to finish editing a bunch of vlogs from this past year that I've gotten behind on of course but yeah I just kind of wanted to update you on where I've been and how I've been doing and all of that Simba is great his vet appointment went really well today he got some vaccines he did good with them and then, you know, Nala's just her chipper old self. So the dogs are great. Hubby's great. It's just me that's a little off the hinge right now. And I want to start feeling better. So that's where we're at. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope you had a wonderful Easter weekend. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're feeling good. And yeah, I'm happy to uh, have vlogged this weekend. It was a little bit difficult getting back on the vlog train, but... I'm going to continue trying, maybe once I'm done with all this nonsense with my health and I'm feeling better, I'll be able to vlog a little bit more, but 
Make sure you follow me on my other social media accounts because I really do stay up to date on all of those. I post on Snapchat almost daily and Instagram probably weekly. So go follow me on there. I'm Casey Keeps Everywhere and I'll see you guys all on another time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Thanks.